still no idea what that is. Oh, hello. Uh, I, I'm, I've got, I found this this morning. Do you know what it is? It was in my collection. I'll, I'll show you, it's one of these. Look at that, oh, can you guess what it is? Look at that, beautiful, fantastic. It's a magnifying glass, that's right. And can you guess what I used to use it for when I was a little boy? Smaller than I am now, much smaller than I am now. I was a lepidopterist. And do you know what a lepidopterist is? They collect uh, butterflies. And, uh, oh, you can use your, uh, your magnifying glass to look at things like this tiny little caterpillar that I've got in my hand and if I look at it with my magnifying glass look it gets bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger until look 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 it's a beautiful oh caterpillar and you know what a caterpillar does all day he eats and he eats and he eats leaves he's eating a leaf there and he eats and eats and eats and and then he goes to bed and then he gets up the next morning and he eats and 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 you get the idea, he eats a lot. But then eventually one day something special happens. You're getting ahead of yourself. Do you know what happens one day? One day he starts to make something. He curls himself up in a tiny ball and he uses his amazing abilities to make something very special. Do you know what it's called? Do you know what it's called? It's called a chrysalis. And they're usually tucked away in dark places. I finally found a use for this. Look at that. I'm gonna put it in there in a dark place because you'll never guess what happens next. No, you'll never guess what happened. Don't tell anybody. Well, well, look, not so far, he's still a chrysalis. You can see he's still a, a chrysalis. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Has something happened? Has something happened? Has something happened? Look everybody, he's turned into a butterfly. Give yourselves a nice big round of applause. That's absolutely fantastic. Now that's fantastic and that's real magic, but is anybody really good at doing magic themselves? Can you make your own butterfly? I'll show you how it's done. Go like this. <laughs> that's easy, isn't it? Go like this, put your finger over the other, like thumb over the other like that, and then bring it up like this and make yourself a butterfly. Make yourself a butterfly, flap your butterfly, flap your butterfly around like that. Let's see all those butterflies. Yours is a really good one, and yours is a really good one, and yours is a really good one. Flap them higher and higher, and if you do it enough, I can find my own little butterfly, and I can take him home and put him in my collection. So that was Practical Magic's Birth of a Butterfly, and a fantastic trick for children's entertainers.